Hello friends, this is Ashirwad here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will be explaining you how to install C++ on Windows 10. The same uh, can be installed on the other versions of Windows as well, like Windows 8 or Windows 7. The process is quite simple. Go to your web browser and uh, here you search for codeplex turbo c++ okay the very first link is uh, this the website you want to go to it says turbo c dot codeplex dot com okay make sure you're opening this website so click on the link and right on the front page click download it will start your download automatically like this so I had already downloaded this file earlier so let me close this and here is the downloaded file it is actually in a compressed format so you need a software like WinRAR to extract the files so make sure you have WinRAR installed or uh, you can use any other third party uh, file extraction tool to extract the files okay to extract the files you just open and extract to desktop or whatever location you want i had already done it so i am not going to repeat the steps so this is the folder you get after extracting files from this rar file after extracting open this folder and run setup it asks for uh, install shield uh, wizard for turbo c++ 3.2 version is what we are going to install fine next accept the license agreement next install click yes if it displays any other message Fine, so it has been installed successfully. Finish, and you can see the shortcut on your desktop. Now, the first time you let me double click on the file and try to open it, it shows this start screen. Okay, the good thing about this uh, C installation is that you are given option for full screen mod. Okay. So if you are um, like interested in full screen mod, uh, you can select this option. I personally prefer window mod, so I will uh, keep it deselected. And the other option says keep this window open for, I don't want to keep this open, so open live example, I don't want any example to be shown right now. So we are good to go now. You can click on this option Turbo C++, start Turbo C++. And as you can see, it loads and your C++ is running fine. The only problem I can see, let me open the editor and try to write a program. Okay. So when I am uh, typing the text, it uh, it looks a bit uh, small, okay, for comfort. So you can increase the window size very easily by uh, making some changes in the in one of the files of the DOS box, okay. So how to do it? Let me show. First, you have to exit this application. Go to your C drive. And here you will find a folder turbo c3 okay open this file and here you will find a file named as dosbox 2o okay this is the file we are uh, interested in so open this file it should open in notepad if not you uh, forcefully specify the system to open this file in notepad but on my computer it has opened so this is the settings for DOSBox and you have to be a little careful 
uh, in making changes because if anything goes wrong it will the application will simply crash okay so here what you are going to do is you have to make some changes here okay full screen mod false full double false full resolution you can specify any resolution you want but I personally prefer 1024 x768 okay make sure it is x not star sign okay same goes for window resolution 1024 x768 the next line output in place of overlay you have to write d draw okay auto lock should be false okay so these are the four settings you have to make in order to increase the size of the window of your C++ IDE so I made the changes you can save it close this window close this window get back to the desktop and now open this application again make sure you have deselected all three options and now hit turbo C++ it works fine as you can see the window size has been increased and uh, now when you type your code it's it's readable it looks better it lo looks comfortable you can always work on full screen mode if you wish to but I personally prefer this window mode because often I need to switch between applications and if you are working on full screen mode it might affect the, the, the display or your screen of your laptop or your computer so I would recommend that you uh, work in window mode it will help you so this was the video of installing C++ on your computer properly Hope it has helped uh, all of you. Thank you so much for watching it. And if you liked it, please subscribe my channel and like. Thank you.